uh, Dustin Hawkins with here with a Fantasy Football Minute. Three names to look at on the waiver wire at the wide receiver position in week six. We mentioned him last week. We'll mention him again. Houston Texans rookie Kiki Kuti. Six out of seven targets he caught this past week for 51 yards and a short touchdown. He still remains involved. There was one thing we were watching after he caught, he caught 11 of 15 targets in his NFL debut back in week four. He backed that up, and he looked good in doing it. I think he fills a role in the Texans' offense. We were looking for validation of those 15 targets. He didn't get targeted 15 times, but seven targets, and the way that he was used creatively, especially close to the goal line, bodes well for him to continue having some value in fantasy football going forward. I like him as a flex play, even in 10-team leagues. If you're going to take a swing at it in PPR formats, you'll see a lot of catches, a lot of targets, I think, moving forward for him. Christian Kirk, another rookie for the Arizona Cardinals, caught a 75-yard touchdown from Josh Rosen. It was a good, optimistic uh, performance for him. He's been pretty active, five or more targets in four straight weeks. Uh, a second-round pick. Yeah, I think the Cardinals really like him a lot. He's working on forming that chemistry with Josh Rosen. They're undergoing some changes offensively. I think Christian Kirk will emerge as, as one of the heavy targets for Josh Rosen moving forward. I like him as a speculative play to see if he can back up that Week 5 performance. And then Robbie Anderson, the, the deep threat for the New York Jets, hadn't been really used a lot as rookie quarterback Sam Darnold kind of gets his legs under him as a rookie uh, starter in the NFL. Two long touchdown passes in this one. If this is something that can continue and Darnold can unlock that deep passing game, Anderson is a proven commodity there, and I like his chance. Coming off a, a two-touchdown performance, I think he must be rostered in all formats. He's a little bit of a boom or bust play so far. He has to be able to back that up in week six and beyond, but I like him to be on a roster and probably deploy him as a flex in most formats. 